Good morning, happy Tuesday. I'm sitting here drinking my coffee and uploading uh, today's Vlogmas video. But what else am I doing? So does anybody else do that? Oh, well, I did the holiday, hello holiday needlework tag in the Vlogmas that's uploading um, today. So yeah, I answered those. But does anybody else play ridiculous games on Facebook? This is the only one that I play. It's called Bingo Bash, I believe is the name of it. Anyway, like you can tell I have been playing for a long time because I'm on level 262. I don't buy chips. I only play with the freebies. But um, yeah, it actually does help quite a lot with the brain fog just having to like match numbers which i know is ridiculous but yeah so that's what i'm doing drinking my coffee playing bingo bash and uploading the vlog so how's your morning starting as soon as i get enough coffee in me i have to finish finish the ornament for my mom's group exchange today and um yeah i am excited to see my lovely friends and um we're having soup and such for lunch and just hanging out together. So I will bring you along for the journey. I'll be back soon. Okay, here's the ornament for my mom's group, FFO'd. I wish I had made it a little narrower because only just a tiny bit of the star peeks out, but I couldn't, there's nothing I could do to fix it after I had uploaded it and everything. So it is what it is, you know, we'll go with it, so. Yep, so that's done. So I probably should get a shower and everything since I'm gonna be leaving the house soon. You know, life. Hello people. It is me, Cece, here again with you on this Vlogmas Day whatever. So my mom's group had our Christmas thing today. One of the ladies in the group couldn't come. They were, they've been ill for a while and it's just taking him a long time to recover. It was so sad, but we had fun. We had soup and bread and cookies and coffee and it was lovely. And then we did um, a, a, an exchange, a gift exchange. Um, nobody stole, but I think <laughs> only three of the four of us were there. And so it was like, because like I was the, the, first one to go and so I you know opened one of the gifts I'm gonna show you what I got in a second I opened one of the gifts and then uh Sophie went but I had gotten what Sophie had brought so she got something from under the tree she got what Mel had given and then Mel could have either stolen from me but not from Sophie because she brought she brought what Sophie got but if she had stolen from me then I would have had to steal from Sophie because my thing was still under the Christmas tree anyway so Mel ended up with what I brought I brought some um different Christmas Christmassy kitchen stuff as well as the ornament that I showed y'all uh just a minute ago but I got what Sophie brought and one thing I got was this beautiful journal and the Dr. Hubs actually loves, loves, loves these wire-bound journals. So I'm going to give it to him to use. So he will be happy. And then she made, let me see if I can pick these up. Because I'm going to hang them on my tree. She made these beautiful um, like pine cone type ornaments out of paper. Well, it's actually like cardstock. But Dammy said there's like hearts on one of them. I don't know what I'm showing you. I think there's hearts on that one and marshmallows on that one. And plaid I am not showing you anything here we go plaid on that one maybe anyway so that was fun it was a lot of fun so um and while I was there I knit most of the preemie hat I was supposed to knit on Sunday but didn't knit because I was trying to get stitching group and mom's group ornaments made so I need to just finish the preemie hat up um I need to gosh it's five o'clock y'all already I need to stitch my square and then I need to work on a stitching Christmas gift. I've showed y'all the Chicken Joy one. So I need to finish that. I don't have a ton left on it, mostly filling in the tree and then like the lights and a little bit on the chicken uh, rooster, whatever you want to call it, and then mount it um, 
So I need to do that. And then um, I'll show y'all as I make them, but I had, um, I had something that was gonna stitch, just a small thing I was gonna stitch for all three of the moms uh, in the moms group besides me, but I ran out of time. So um, I asked them their favorite colors, they told me, and I'm gonna get those stitched and I'll get them to them. It may be after the first of the year because we're not gonna meet next week because it's Christmas Eve. Although Russ and Dammy will be at work. So, um, but then they're off for Christmas Day and Boxing Day. I think Dammy's off Boxing Day. Are you off on Boxing Day? What? Are you off on Boxing Day? The 26th? Yes, she is. She's off on Boxing Day. Um, and then she has to... What? I'm telling them on my Vlogmas. Um, and then Dammy works on the 27th, but the Dr. Hubs is off and Dammy gets off early afternoon and then that's when we're going to go see the new Star Wars movie. So I'm really excited. Okay, I've been jabbering for a lot. Can you tell I've had sugar? Okay, I am going to try to finish the preemie hat before I have to go pick up the Dr. Hubs from the ferry and hopefully get started also on um, today's square. So I'll be back to show y'all um, that stuff as well as hopefully I can get some progress, more progress on Chicken Joy. Okay, bye friends. Okay, I'm back. I forgot. I wanted to rant for a second. So, in our bathroom, above the mirror, there are eight light bulbs. And they're not traditional light bulbs. They're like the globe ball ones. And three of them burned out. And I've been trying to find replacements. So, I took one of the burned out ones that I could not tell what the wattage was, hoping that whoever worked there could help me. Oops, sorry. Uh, I'm holding the the phone in my hand. There we go. Um, hoping the employee could help me. So I go to a hardware store, a national chain hardware store, and I look for myself and I was like, I can't figure this out. I went to the customer service desk and said, could you get somebody to help me in the light bulbs? And I waited probably seven or eight minutes and nobody ever came. So what did I do? I pulled up their phone number on the website I called and I was like, hmm, I asked for help at the customer service desk from somebody. Nobody ever came. Could you please get someone to help me? And they finally got somebody to help me, but it was somebody who was not from that department. So they didn't really know as much as they needed to, but he was able to figure out the wattage. And then we had to search and finally, I'm the one that found the right wattage. He couldn't find it. They look different. I mean, like they're still globe, but the ones we have right now in the bathroom are frosted because that's what it was when we moved in to the apartment. Um, and these ones are not. These are clear, um, but I'm like, I don't care. I didn't want to replace all eight light bulbs at once. I'm like, I'll replace them as they go out. And so, but if somebody asks for help at the customer service desk, you should really kind of send somebody to help. I know it's a busy time of year, but... I was there at like four o'clock in the afternoon. It wasn't like I was there after work hours and people are coming in to do stuff or on the weekend. Just a little rant. When customers ask for help, you should help get somebody to help them. Okay, rant over. Now I'm gonna go craft. Um, here is my finished Capri hat. I think this is number 50 for the year, I think. I don't have a calendar in front of me and I can't look on my phone because I'm recording with my phone, but. My free top-down premium hat pattern you can get on Ravelry, and I knit one every week. So, here's another one. All right, today I know what these are. Day 17, chocolate chip cookies, and um, yeah, so I'm 17 days in, eight more squares to go, and then um, I think it was a stitching group. Last night, we were talking about how, because I continue to do Vlogmas all the way through the end of the month, so maybe I can work on the two borders, or the, because there's like a red and white border underneath the squares and above the squares, and then there's the houses up here, and then there's a white border. Um, maybe I can continue to work on just some every day all the way through the end of Vlogmas just to see how far I can get. We're super excited to be doing 31 Days of Christmas again this year. Every week this month, we'll have a different theme where you can save 25% off each pattern with the coupon code 31days. 
coupon code is the same every week. The patterns are different though every week. For the third week of December, Sunday the 15th through Saturday the 21st, you can get 25% off all of our sock patterns with the coupon code 31 days and there's 46 of them. We have created a bundle where you can find all of these patterns. We I will put a link in the drop down box below to get straight to that bundle. The final three days of December we'll be doing a special sale on all of our ebooks. In addition this year we decided we would like to do random acts of kindness. So every day this month from the 1st to the 28th you'll be able to enter to win any one of our patterns. Each day you will choose a pattern from the sale bundle for that week you will respond on the post in my Instagram account, cc underscore almond. I'll put a link in the drop down box. You'll post on that post with your Ravelry username and which pattern from the sale bundle for that week you would like to win. You will also need to make sure that you follow me on Instagram and like the post. I will close the thread the following morning and do a random uh, generator to choose the winner. The last three days of the month, we will be doing a very, very special ebook giveaway. Just a reminder that if you do not follow the directions completely when you enter, your and you and if you're drawn chosen the winner, your entry will be invalid, and I will have to choose another winner. And a disclosure disclaimer that Instagram is not uh, a sponsor of this at all. Uh, this is something simply coming from Danny and I. The winner for the 17th is Coffee and Yarn Cakes, and I gifted her the Diamonds in the Mind socks. Head over to my Instagram to enter to win today.